Hello, in front of me I've got Moza R5 Racing Simulator set. In this video I'll show you how to manage Moza Pit House app. In the beginning make sure that your steering wheel base is connected with PC via USB cable. And then, as you can see on the main page of the app, we can change maximum steering angle We can select presets between Formula, GT, Hypercar and Sports. Next, we can change Game Force Feedback Intensity for Base. And for Pedals, we can change Throttle between Minimum, Maximum, Brake between Minimum, Maximum and Clutch between Minimum and Maximum. Next, we can manage Game Launcher and start racing games directly from the app. Take a look at the left bar. Right here, you can go to Basic Settings. For Base, you can change presets between Drift, Formula GT, Karting, Performance Rally Track, change Maximum Steering Angle, Road Sensitivity, Game Force Feedback Intensity, maximum wheel speed, wheel spring strength, and wheel damper. Next, you can go to advanced settings, FFB effect equalizer, base FFB curve, and miscellaneous. Next, we can manage steering wheel settings. Here, you can check combination explanation, change SIG mode between button and D-pad, Change engine RPM indicator switch mode between RPM indicator off and on. Next, you can adjust combination settings. Next, you can change engine RPM ID indicator timing. Then, you can enter and manage pedals settings. Here you can manage clutch, brakes and throttle pedals. Next we can manage dashboard, switch, shifter, handbrake, second shifter, Multifunction stalk, and we can check the dashboard via app. In system settings, we can manage language, dark mode, Bluetooth, boot up, and more. Then we can reset and calibrate. And in experimental functions, we can check history version and more. And that's basically it. If you find this video helpful, please leave like, comment and subscribe.